New for 2023 is the dual-purpose KLX 230SE, designed to be lightweight and easily maneuverable for both trail and street riding, the KLX 230SE features a four-stroke 233 cubic centimeters air-cooled engine with electric start and compact steel perimeter frame. The short 54.3-inch wheelbase along with the high 10.4-inch ground clearance adds to the maneuverability of the bike. The KLX 230SE also features front and rear disc brakes, a 21-inch front and 18-inch rear wheel, a front fork with 8.7 inches of travel suspension, and a rear suspension with 8.8 .8 inches of wheel travel. In terms of the features of the Kawasaki KLX 230-2023, Apart from using the main lights which are LED, of course it still retains some of its flagship features. One of them is the use of a full digital panel meter with a fairly minimalist design. There are speed indicators, fuel indicators, battery indicators, digital clocks, odometers, trip A and B, and several other indicator lights. The latest Kawasaki KLX 230SE 2023 design now uses a headlamp, aka LED main light. The KLX 230S is a trendsetter for trail bikes in Indonesia that uses LED headlight. This is because other Japanese brand dirt bikes haven't used this type of light. LED lights with top and bottom reflectors, but in terms of design it still looks big. Of course it's still quite solid to use as lighting on on-road and off-road roads. As for the design of the other parts, it still looks the same. This motorbike carries a design that is still similar to the Kawasaki KLX 2302022, which is still very good in terms of design. For other lighting systems, both turn signals and rear lights, unfortunately, they still use ordinary halogen bulbs. There are several differences for the SE type, starting from the presence of hand guards, frame covers, engine cowl, and of course the upside-down front suspension. In addition, there are also several other differences in terms of appearance compared to the standard version.